So far, you've downloaded and installed Xcode and opened your first playground. You can think of playgrounds as a scratch pad to test, learn, and practice code. As you move along, you'll find that you can create a playground at any time. For example, perhaps you're in a giant project and building the next killer app. You can even add a playground to those projects to test and try out code before you add it to your app. That way, you can test things out without breaking anything. Playgrounds make coding fun, so it's an awesome place to test, play, and experiment with new things. Let's get started. First of all, delete everything you see here and start fresh. On the left is a place where you can enter your code, and on the right, it will actually evaluate or run the code that you've written, and you can see the output on the right-hand side. When you start a new programming language, it's common to start with what's called a Hello World application. And that just means printing Hello World in the language of your choice. In Swift, a Hello World application is easier than you think. Can you guess what we're going to type? Print Hello World. Now, if you hit the center icon here, this is the debug area, so you can actually see the output. Hello World. There you have it. You successfully created your first Hello World application with Swift. It's a badge of honor for every new language. And now you're one step closer to becoming a developer.